if you're wondering uh, what the singing is, it's a uh, karaoke here in the Philippines, one of the favorite pastimes. This karaoke happens to be in my living room. I am in the bedroom. And sometimes the toddler gets a hold of the mic and he wants to sing and he screams so loud that it starts to whistle, you know, feedback. You know, do, 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 do the brain. I think that can take you on a little tour to see who's out there. Let's see. Sunday. Uh, like I gotta say they really like karaoke here in the Philippines. Uh, back in the day, you know, we used to have little tiny karaoke. Every time you say something at a high level, it just squeals and makes feedback. Um, Got to spend a lot of good money. You know, to get a better karaoke machine, unless you want feedback. <laughs> you know, so that's happening in in, in, in Mindanao. Um, this is about as far down as you can get, except for uh, General Santos in the uh, Philippines, uh, and the other place that's lower is Australia. Unless you want to go to South Pole. <laughs> uh, had enough of that cold over in America. Well, I'm not going there. So, uh, there's people outside, they were doing, yeah, they're still doing karaoke outside. You can hear them too. Let's see. A lot of tricycles out there right now, but you can hear them. It's karaoke like all over the place today. Let's see if we can hear them. So I'm just going to chill in here and uh, enjoy some air con, and relax, maybe get a cup of coffee later, you know. <laughs> um, it's a very nice day, i got to admit, uh, it's probably about, I don't know, 80 four degrees maybe eight degrees something like that is very nice uh, you gotta come to the Philippines you know complete your journey to the Southeast Asian Sea you know Southeast Asia is the bomb man
to keep asking me to sing. And uh, that mic and me just don't get along. I'm used to other mics, sure mics, you know. <laughs> I don't know how she does it. I'd have that thing whistling and feedback, making feedback noises like a Jimi Hendrix guitar, you know, to a loud amp system, you know. Yeah. Plus I got a, a deep bear voice, you know. <laughs> you know, I want to hit that on Hit those barrel notes in the uh, it's a lot of people um that will never take the chance to uh come out here and uh visit the Philippines or any place else, they'll just stay stuck where they are. It's either that uh, fortune isn't smiling on them or they're afraid. Uh, gotta get over your fear, you know. Uh, let's just... I don't, wait a minute, some, something just showed up on my Mac screen, let's see what this is. I don't know what the, what that means, if you like I can search the web, oh, it's Siri. Siri! Siri! You listening? Hmm, I don't have an answer for that. Um, What's the degrees in the Philippines, Siri? Oh, in Manila. Say it again, Siri. Oh, that's 82 degrees in Manila. What about Davao, Siri? Oh. It's 82 degrees, so, eh. Sunny 70% chance for rain. Uh, so, uh, it's probably the rain. Here's what I found. Will it rain in the in the bowel, Siri? I don't know. <laughs> Never mind, Siri. Um, what's my name, Siri? See if he gets that. You're Glenn, but since we are friends, I get to call you Bill. Thank you, Siri. Okay. Um, do you like karaoke, Siri? Let's see if I can answer it. I found this on the web. Well, not that. I'm trying to get used to Siri. Um, let's see. Do you like karaoke, Siri? Hmm, I don't have an answer for that. Is there something else I can help with? No, it's because you're an automated robot that you don't know anything about karaoke because that's a machine too. But thank you, Siri. Bye. Okay. I think I'm going to get rid of Siri. Okay, do you like karaoke, Siri? Sorry, you can also type what you are looking for. Okay, but no need for all that. <sighs> They've got to be placed in my front door. Um, that's broken. <laughs> and a female did it, of course. Uh, honey May broke the front door. <laughs> So that front door has got to be replaced. It was old. I mean, old, old. So, 
the whole door's got to be placed for like uh, 8,500 pesos. I gotta pay that to the property owner. They're gonna put a brand new door up there. I, I wanted a new door for so long because the door is like too short, you know? Uh, the door is like that tall. Beneath it and above it, there's like cracks about that big, you know? And um, I keep thinking something's gonna crawl under it. I remember finding bullfrogs at the door. It rained hard, and I'm wondering, where did these bullfrogs come from? I, I, I've got to get a new door, so that's going to be taken care of on the fourth. Uh, good Lord, Creator, allow, you know what I mean? I'm going to go ahead and pay that and uh, have them do that work. Um, we need new screens in here, too. Uh, we don't want to catch dinghy, you know. Nothing worse than a house full of mosquitoes, whether you're living in the Philippines or in America. Uh, and from what I understand, America has a, a new uh, scare coming out with mosquitoes. Malaria? Yeah, they have a new malaria scare. I uh, hope it doesn't get serious because nobody wants malaria or dinghy. You know what I mean? I don't like flies. Uh, I mean, flies give me the chills. You know why? Because they're laying on top of crap, and you're stuck with the that feeling that, gee, this fly just left me something extra on my bread. Mm-hmm. And you don't want to eat that bread. You, as a matter of fact, you'll tear it off, take that piece. Some people have thrown away whole meals because a fly touched it, and I don't blame them. You know, especially if it's like uh, liquid. Ugh, you know, mm. <sighs> so I try to keep the flies out. Um, I, got a, I got a thing that I use uh, to keep mosquitoes and flies out. Let's see if I can locate it for you. Uh, huh. Found it. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. What's it called? Um, I use this. Um, looks like uh, there's a coil that you burn. <laughs> looks like that. Um, so for it comes apart. Sometimes I have a hard time getting this thing apart, and uh, it's frustrating. And um, it's this little centerpiece right there, it just locks, you know. It's like a Rubik's Cube you get apart. So instead, I just uh, break a piece off like that. Um, I can't light it now because uh, I don't have a lighter. But you light it, stick it in something, let it sit, let it smoke. You know, from it, uh, chase off the mosquitoes and uh, stuff. Don't get too close to this stuff because I think it can give you like a lung infection, man. I'm telling you. But it works. Mosquito taste this stuff. It's all night mosquito protection. Yeah. And it's cheap. Um, it really is. I got 12 coils in this box. So, that's pretty much my Sunday. Uh, can't wait for Monday. Um, that's about it. Take care and peace out.